warning comes days after fierce clashes between the Sudanese army and the rabbit support forces in Sudan's North Darfur state. The escalating violence has left dozens dead and thousands displaced. Many people remain trapped in Al Fashir city, which is home to around 800,000 people. It's the last major city in the vast western Darfur region, not yet under the control of the RSF. The UN rights chief, Volker Turk, claims the rival military groups have launched indiscriminate attacks using shells and rockets in residential districts, killing women and children. There are further allegations that the RSF burned down villages in western Al Fashir, including Derma, Umushush, Serafaya, and Osbani. The RSF and its allies have also been blamed for carrying out ethnically driven killings against non Arab groups and other violations in West Darfur. Meanwhile, Sudan has requested the UN Security Council to look into allegations that UAE is supporting the RSF. But the United Arab Emirates has denied the claims, saying the Sudanese government is trying to divert attention from the deteriorating humanitarian situation in the country. Neba Muhiddin, CGTN, for Sudan.